Dark Souls 2. Now, I went back and I, you know, I realized that one of the drawbacks of trying to do a let's play and talking at the same, you know, doing commentary while playing, is I tend not to really concentrate on doing things I normally would do, which is like explore and things of that nature. So earlier today, I went back and I started playing, and I realized I missed tons of stuff. So I didn't want to record it over again. So, but I, I started another character because the, the class that I chose was not really the class I wanted. So I went and I started a new character, went through the process, and since I wasn't having to worry about uh, talking or commentating, it was much easier for me to just go right ahead and, uh, you know, explore, and, and I got a bunch of stuff, and I'm going to go ahead and go to, uh, I believe it was this way if I remember well, you know, and I came through here exploring, and I did open that chest right there, and, uh, you know, I got to the area where there's like, you know, I got my Estus Flask, you know, all that stuff. And I really realized that I really wasn't concentrating the way I should, or the way I normally do when I play these games. So, anyway, so, you know, I came through here. I, the first time I opened this door, I was standing back here like this, with my shields. <laughs> I was all prepared. And, um, alright, come on, there we go. So, yeah. So, you know, I went through this tunnel, and across the bridge, went down there, I got that uh, chest down there, which was the, uh, I believe it was an effigy, so I didn't try to get this guy yet, but I'm actually going to try that now, see where this goes, I don't know if the current's going to, this is going to be my first time trying this, so I may very well die, but let's give it a shot, uh, oh, oh, there we go, so let's see what this guy has, a homeward bone and soul of lost and dead, okay, good. So, I don't know if I can get out of here. That, I mean... Oh, it looks like it takes me right into where I need to go, so... Let's let's follow the... And this is why I want to kill one of those ogres. I heard, I heard that they dropped a uh, stone ring, which I believe is supposed to allow you to walk through the water faster. So, and I got... This is as far as I got. And then you see the bonfire over there? I already lit it. And then that's where I stopped, so... So, let's take this guy out here. These guys have a pretty large aggro range. Alright. Come on, boy. Come on, boy. So if you see me get quiet for a while, it just means that I'm going to be concentrating on where to go next and where to explore. I don't really want to miss anything. Uh, I, I couldn't believe how much I missed while I was in that cave. Uh, the, the new cave, so to speak. So, alright. Oh. Oh, they're both coming for me, huh? Oh, look at that! Bow and arrow and all that good stuff. Alright, let me kill him. Oh, no, no, no. Alright, what did he drop? Oh, good, life gem. Alright, so as you can see, my character's hollow right now. over here, and well, a lot of blood stains. Now, yesterday when I played, I wasn't able to get online. I guess they were having some issues with the uh, with the servers, but I'm online today, so blood stains all over the place. Not a very encouraging sight. So, alright, so that's it. Let's check in there. Of course, these guys respawn, but I just wanted to make sure that when I die, I come back here. Plus, I don't mind getting the souls anyway. I gotta worry about over here. That dude right there. Oh, him too. Look at that. See? Don't worry about the guy with the bow. Come on, homie. Come on. Alright. Ooh! Barely got that shield up on time. Alright, you're dead. There's another bow right there. Alright, so let's go back down here. You know, sometimes the water can be tricky. It kind of gets deep, and then next thing you know. Before you know it, you're in deep water and you're sinking your dead. Happened a lot during Dark Souls. Oh, here we are. Oh! I was kind of expecting that. That's why That's why I always kind of turn around with my shield up and shit like that, because i played this game too many times. Not this particular one, but played the Soul series enough times to know that uh, whenever you think it's safe, it really isn't. Quick climb. I love that new feature. Oh shit. Quite a few bad boys up here. 
Oh! Alright, this would be interesting. I saw during a, a play on a website that if you hit, this guy won't bother you unless you hit him. So I am going to fight him, but I'm going to make sure I take this guy up there out first. So I don't have to worry about... Uh... Oh, an effigy. Nice. That way I don't have to worry about getting plastered with arrows while I fight him. I don't even know if I'm ready to fight him. I mean, it's not like I'm that high level. But uh, if I could find this ladder, if there is one... Uh, I guess I gotta go through the fog. Whoa. Let's see what's over here first. Oh, there's a ladder. That's what I, ah, there's, there's a spot. Okay, so I know I, where I can go to get that. Alright. So let's just hope by going up this ladder I don't run into any other surprises, but it is very likely that I do. Just kind of want to peek first. Oh, oh there it is. Taking him out by storm. Alright, no surprises there. Um, Alright, I wanted this. Oh, he should be on this ledge here somewhere. There he is. There's my friend. Alright, let's see if I can get my jump down. Let's see if I. Improved on my jump a little bit. Uh, a little bit. Not pretty, but it got the job done. Short sword, soul lost on the head. <sighs> Don't think that short sword is better than what I have, because the weapon I'm using now is gives me a dex bonus, so. Well, that's okay. I wanted to come down here anyway to fight this guy. But not yet. Not just yet. I want to see if I can get on the. Oh! -ho! Nice try. Nice try. You're you're talking. You're you're messing with a veteran here. Sorry, you don't fall for that shit. All right. Oof, they try to sneak him up on you, huh? All right. So we. I think I see it. Let's see if I can get the best winning start possible. I'm gonna go for this thing. Ah, almost, and I died in the process. <laughs> it was worth a gamble, I guess. Had I hit the ledge, I would have been okay, I think. There's one there. There's one wandering. Let's wait here. hear it before. Hmm. Must be a way to get up there. Oh, there we are. Very carefully. There we are. Soul of the Nameless Soldier. Hmm. Oh, this doesn't look very friendly. Alright, so. And... Oof. Lessons learned. Let's see if I can get up.
bitch. nerve-wracking. Ah, oh, still got me. Oh, running out of life turns fast. Oh! Nah, you threw me off on that one. It's safe to just chill out for a minute. Trying to see if I can draw that guy out. this for a quick second I'm gonna go level and then I will come back right here at this very spot hopefully with a bow and arrow okay guys welcome back <laughs> so <clears throat> did not find a bow and arrow did do some leveling up, so it looks like I'm gonna have to take this guy on, but I believe I have some throwing daggers. So we're gonna try that. I have three, I don't even know if that's enough to take them out, but we're gonna give it a shot. big boy I'm gonna do a lot of damage with those daggers I might have to stock up on those very 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 nifty all right so let's see where we're at here all right there's a ladder anything significant over here oh I see something shiny over there here's another enemy
right. Nice gem, very good. A buckler. Wow, that's a nice sight. Okay, so I don't seem to be able to go that way, so we will go up the ladder nice and slowly. Make sure we don't get snuck up on. Big man, let's dance. Oh shit. Holy shit. Um. Fuck. slow, but he had he covered so much ground with that weapon. There we go. Oof. Oh, bonfire. Thank you, Lord. Right on time for my scimitar to get cured, too. Or, uh, fixed, rather. Alright, payback time. Courtyard, I was like, whoa, what is that big thing up there? What is that? Oh, shit. There's somebody in the corner. There always is. Why is this a surprise? It's funny, I remember fighting the first one a little while ago and I was so tentative. Now that I know I can kill him in three shots, I just look for the opening and take it. Oh, uh, I don't I don't like the looks of this. This looks like a trap. Holy Alright guys, we're gonna call it here. <laughs> I need to 
I need to take a little bit of time to figure how to figure out how I'm gonna do that. <laughs> Alright guys, it's been fun. I'll see you on the next one. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Dark Souls 2. Now, I went back and I you know I realized that one of the drawbacks of trying to do a let's play and talking at the same you know, doing commentary while playing is I tend not to really concentrate on doing things I normally would do, which is like explore and things of that nature. So earlier today I went back and I started playing and I realized I missed tons of stuff. So I didn't want to record it over again. So, but I, I started another character because the, the class that I chose was not really the class I wanted. So I went and I started a new character, went through the process, and since I wasn't having to worry about uh, talking or commentating, it was much easier for me to just go right ahead and, uh, you know, explore, and, and I got a bunch of stuff, and I'm going to go ahead and go to, uh, I believe it was this way if I remember well, you know, and I came through here exploring, and I did open that chest right there, and, uh... You know, I got to the area where there's like, you know, I got my Estus Flask, you know, all that stuff. And I really realized that I really wasn't concentrating the way I should, or the way I normally do when I play these games. So, anyway, so, you know, I came through here. I, the first time I opened this door, I was standing back here like this, with my shields. <laughs> I was all prepared. And, um, alright, come on, there we go. So, yeah. So, you know, I went through this tunnel, and... Across the bridge, went down there, I got that uh, chest down there, which was the, uh, I believe it was an effigy, so I didn't try to get this guy yet, but I'm actually going to try that now, uh, see where this goes, I don't know if the current's going to, this is going to be my first time trying this, so I may very well die, but let's give it a shot, uh, oh, oh, there we go, so let's see what this guy has, a homeward bone and soul of lost and dead, okay, good. So, I don't know if I can get out of here. That, I mean... Well, it looks like it takes me right into where I need to go, so... Let's let's follow the... And this is why I want to kill one of those ogres. I heard, I heard that they dropped a uh, stone ring, which I believe is supposed to allow you to walk through the water faster. So, and I got... This is as far as I got. And then you see the bonfire over there? I already lit it. And then that's where I stopped, so... So, let's take this guy out here. These guys have a pretty large aggro range. Alright. Come on, boy. Come on, boy. So if you see me get quiet for a while, it just means that I'm going to be concentrating on where to go next and where to explore. I don't really want to miss anything. Uh, I, I couldn't believe how much I missed while I was in that cave. Uh, the, the new cave, so to speak. So, 